As if losing our homes wasn't bad enough. We have to see Mongols in them as well. I've seen too many homes raided. Burned to the ground. They took a home nearby a few days ago. The man who lived there won't leave the area. He keeps begging for help. I'll try and find him. Calm down. Who's been taken? The invaders took our house. Down the road. My wife is there. With my son. You left your family behind? What choice did I have? I'm no warrior. <sighs> I'll help them. Stay here. Son of the family here, maybe outside. Laundry, still damp. The attack was sudden. Killed here. Bodies were dragged, thrown in the water. A child's toy. His family didn't survive. I should let him know. My lord, did you find them? Hmm. Your family was killed. I'm sorry. Why didn't you save them? I ran like a coward. I should be dead too. It's 
not your fault. Don't let their deaths be in vain. Resist the invaders. Help those in need. Yes, my lord. Some say the Chitsune are innocent people. That's what they do.
They've taken the bridge! Tell me. We were running for Hiyoshi Springs. The bridge looked safe, but the Mongols were in the ravine. They, they, they started shooting from below. Someone's injured. Banta! My brother's boy! They're using him as bait. Tell your family to stay clear of the bridge. I'll stop this. There's storm shooting! It is over. Go to your family. Thank you, my lord. The bridge is clear!
The Mongols are gone. Did they scream? Their suffering isn't your concern. Take your family to Hiyoshi Springs. These roads are dangerous. We will. Thank you. the Mongols' black powder into a clay pot, I can set it aflame and throw it as a weapon. Samurai in the heart. Lord Sakai, come quickly. Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farmstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as head man, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. He must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake, but his brother, Hachi, is a fool. 
He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. We have to go, or we will lose him. After what happened at the inn, I didn't think you'd visit the temple again. I came to watch for Sadao's brother. Dead. Have you given your family a proper funeral? Not while their killers walk free. After my father died, I said goodbye to him that same night. It helped ease my pain. I buried them. That will have to do. No. When's the last time you slept? Or ate? I had some rice and fish yesterday. Even the youngest warrior needs a full belly and a rested sword arm. Are you calling me old, Lord Sakai? <laughs> I wouldn't dare. My sword arm works just fine. We should have caught up to Hachi by now. Which way do you think he went? Both roads look traveled. Let's search the area. He can't be far. Masako, look. The man with the cart. That's Hachi, Sado's brother. He's leaving. And we will follow. Close, but out of sight. Behave yourself, Ringo. Or no carry for you when we're done. Nice weather for a walk. <laughs> if we run into Mongols, my old friend, you're on your own. Visitors. We can't let them see us. What do you have in your heart? Food? Water? Other things? Sure. Uh, of course. You will promise that. Not yet, but I have something for your guest. It's a meeting. We'll pass it along. He handed them a note. I'll stop here again at the usual time. We'll meet you there. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses. That man is an idiot. He's the headman's brother. Still an idiot. But he has good sake. Not today. Today all he had was a note. <laughs> that note is more important than your life. If we fail to deliver, the headman will kill us. So those are family. <laughs> From a bad family. His cousins are bandits. Remember the riots that erupted when Kuta Farmstead was short on rice? Yes. Who do you think hired the bandits that slaughtered the protesters? Edwin Sado. The coward. I know it. Right. The next time you think of the head man, remember the Kuta massacre.
woodcutter's house, guarded by bandits. Sada's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Send your best warrior!
Corpses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them talk. Let me try first. <laughs> I'm not going to hurt you. My name is Sakai. Who are you? Hina, Sada's wife. My husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I, I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. And she can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. She is going to kill me. No harm will come to you. the mighty samurai skill. Ah! <laughs> 
You and Lord Shumanov survived, my lord. I'm glad they're true. You're free. Go somewhere safe. I thought I had. Made myself a camp along the river that separates Azamo from Tutsu. The Mongols moved in and started cutting down all the trees. Making siege weapons, I think. I'll find their logging camp and make sure they never finish their work. Kishi grasslands. Straw hat mercenaries were seen in the area. Mongol convoy ambushed. Could be the straw hats doing. Attack started to hear, but there had to be more than one Mongol. Looks like more bodies up ahead. <laughs> Trying to get away from his attackers.
Jin Sakai. Yuzo. You look like a scarecrow. You've looked better too. <laughs> Can I have my hat? You're a mercenary now. Professional warrior. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for your leader. He died on Komoda Beach. You were there too. I lost a lot of friends. We all did. And we can avenge them if we work together. Help me save Lord Shimura. He's alive. The straw hats are hurt. Starving. I can't ask them to risk their lives for one man. Even if you can name your price? Once we free our home, Lord Shimura will pay you anything you want. My men might be interested. Your men? I look out for them. Someone has to. Do we have a deal? I'll think about it. it is ready. Hold your ground. I always do. It's a bad guy in the old. This is for Komoda Beach. Kill them all. Your form has improved. And you managed to grow a beard. 
Have you considered my offer? The Straw Hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food, and I'm returning to my men empty-handed. But not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. You're all right. Come on. When was the last time we saw each other? Two summers ago. Lord Nagao's tournament. I looked for you after the tournament ended. Straw Hats saw our duel. They needed a new sword. Seemed like fun. You never visited my uncle's castle. There wasn't work there. I would have helped you become a retainer of Clan Shimura. You only had to ask. I made my own way. Another wagon. Might have something we can salvage. I am empty. Samurai! Samurai! Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. I meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? Name your price. Free sake for life. Is that all? A place to drink. Big enough for all my men. Be serious, Ryuzo. I know you want to be more than a mercenary. It's been three years, Jin. Things change. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Komodo Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. But it's starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half, but still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. Do you have an idea? The beginning of one. Who goes there? Easy, Shinzo. It's me. He's here! He use those back! About time. I don't see any food. Who's the samurai? Men, this is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Ryuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the Straw Hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. You'd better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. You're not as handsome as me, but it's not bad. <laughs> we should check the fort's defenses. Look for weak spots. My men will handle that part. Then we have a deal? Get us that food at the Fort Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just remember who's in charge of the Straw Hats. I would never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. See you there.
Men! Men. Moving out. Moving out. 